Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas. I'm your host, and I'm here with T N T Dino Might. Boom. I'm the man on the sticks. He We're is. playing Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Valhalla. <laughs> We're on the move. His name is Dag. <laughs> Dag, yo! You'll be happy to have my feet on solid ground again. We must not rush Is verbal blackface? Oh, you see here. Say verbal blackface? <laughs> oh, you just said. <laughs> Largely unpacified. There will be eyes watching us from the trees with bows drawn and traps set. Yeah, we, we ain't worried. We must be Randy, take in your oars. All standing. Have you spotted something? Not yet. Yeah, let's go let kill go everybody in this village. Of any dangers. Then follow our lead when the sun brushes the horizon. Understood. May God bless you all on your way. We will see you soon. Dude, see now this is ride or die right here. Whatever these green thumbed fairy folk have to throw at us. Fairy folk? Are you ride or dying the right now? There's no coming. snow. They do not. They will not scoff at our visit. Oh, you of can the swim four kingdoms now. In England, the sons of Ragnar have settled only one. <gasps> the rest is ripe for the taking. Do we mean to join their army? No. No. Oop, somebody we put the sun visor down. Get the lay of the land. Lens flares a and beat. carve this country into as many pieces as we see fit. Look ahead there. Oh, I can get is close. Is that for a town? Plain brick in a single rune to their timid god? That hmm. rune is called a root, Doug. The cross upon which their god was sacrificed. It sits atop a monastery, a place of worship. <laughs> They're talking Those about the cross. Price, and now they display okay. it in worship? <laughs> they Lord, worship a rune? We idols of our gods and make wishes before them. Like our sacrifices to Odin, the one-eyed. But we do not worship the wolf that kills him. That is the difference. Whatever strangeness we see in these Saxons, uh -oh, they must think the same of us. The hammer. Now there is a symbol worthy of a god. <laughs> a bolt of lightning would take that cross clean off. <laughs> <laughs> Casual blasphemy. Casual blasphemy. Is that a subreddit? Uh, it might be. Should be. What is... What are they doing? They're ritual killing drowning. the Lord. Baptism. A ritual drowning. <laughs> ritual drowning. <laughs> nice Cassandra face. I know, right? The, the camera's so screwed right now. Don't mind us. We're just murdering people in the water. If you're having a baptism, Jonas, it's a baptism. He said drowning. Because yeah, he doesn't get it. Because he doesn't get it. It's fish out of water. Oh, I get it. <laughs> they were making fun of the cross because they said it looked like a rune. And they were like, that's not a good symbol for Jesus. The way forward is blocked by a chain spanning the river. We must remove it before passing on. A chain? Can we cut through it? It's too thick for access. Well, there must be a way to release it somewhere in that camp. All right, so. And I will be right behind you. <laughs> Infiltrate the camp, kill the Christians. Kill Jesus followers? Yeah. Good idea. Release the chain. The arrow and keep your sharpest axe at hand, huh? Something like that. Oh, see, so now this is the whole idea of how, like, the Vikings came to England. It's it's historically accurate. It was like the Vikings came to uh, to England, and they were all like Christians, and they were civilized and everything. And then they just came and started killing people. Oh, R and P and uh, yeah, a little bit of that. Okay, you you do you, you know about like this sort of history type of stuff, right? I don't know. I, I watched that Viking show, and this while it's not like historically God. accurate, it did give me some idea of how the ish went down, and it's pretty interesting. It's like generally accurate, not historically accurate. Well, I mean, it definitely happened that these guys just came out and just started like killing Christians. And they were just being. yeah, <laughs> they literally just like walked into the civilized streets of uh, 
of like England, and they would just like walk into monasteries and be like, "You guys don't have any weapons? We'll just kill you all. This is easy. This is the easiest thing ever." Except a I Dane. Just, a Dane has come. I hate when Danes come. Come on. You're hiding in the bushes. Don't worry. You got them. Nope. They went away. Never mind. You can still whistle, dude. It's, it's, <laughs> yeah, just... it's the same game. Yeah. Are you expecting a different game? Nope. <laughs> this is a, what Assassin's Creed has always been. Kill that man. You did. All right. I think I got everybody. Yeah. They all died. <laughs> I could probably get you from right here. Aw, oh, come on, really? I missed, because I'm bad. Uh, yes. I'm bad, dude! I'm bad! Now they're all coming to get you. No, he's the only one. Nope. He was not the only one. He is the only one. If he was, he wouldn't be in this song. This hammer goes to his dome. Here comes some more down the ladder, dude. I don't think there's any repercussions for my actions, though, to be honest. So. Oh, there's like, there's like no, like, uh, yeah, there's no police. You haven't run into any cops? Dude, that's really cool. I kind of like, I kind of hate it, to be honest, because it makes, like, there's no, what's the game, then? It's <laughs> you killing everything, dude, and becoming a little mass killer. There's no, there's no, there's and no Lerilla? game. It's I'm like a, natural a, born killer. A, a game is like rewards versus punishments, and like yeah, it's like even in tic tac toe. If you put your piece in, if you put your X in the wrong place, guess what? You this lose. Huge. That no. means it takes some sort of skill. Like if you take I away like any shoot. danger, it'd be like playing GTA without the cops to run away from. I'd oh, be, I wish you could turn them off sometimes. Oh my god, there's no game. <laughs> then Not all I of the time, but turn like, them down. Maybe I their wish level that, of like, aggro. If you wanted to, you could be like no cop mode, and you could just like go on a rampage, and you would have no. Okay, and I, I respect that. Is that sometimes you don't want to interact with them all, but I think that's more of like, like I said, it's like the exception, not, not the rule. Having the option versus like just like saying hey. right. The option is great because it is fun to run from the cops and the FBI and the army and all that ish. But it would be cool sometimes to have no repercussions if that's what you want. Yeah, to yeah. And there's, there's actually, there are ways to do that in like a GTA. But I'm just saying, it's like there's, there's no game if, if there's no repercussions. There's for no anything. consequence. Yeah, I got you. <laughs> like, cause in the old GTAs, you could turn off cop mode. Yeah, with you a still cheat code can. or whatever. You still can. All right, I just killed all those guys. So you know, that's the same thing as doing it stealthily. Basically. Are you just going to climb the mast? I guess I'm just going to climb the mast. <laughs> you never climbed the mast before? I mean, I masked the climb, but I don't climb the mast. Ooh. Mast the climb. I like that. That's a good rapper name. <laughs> mast the climb? <laughs> M-A-S-S-D-A-C-L-I-M-B? Yeah. All together, one word? Absolutely. That's my rap name. We All right. On until we, reach our goal. we cannot afford another surprise. Now be on your guard. It should not be far. Nope. Gods, I'm ravenous. I hope they have food and the ale on hand when we arrive. No, you, you should have don't. sent word ahead of us, Sigurd, to get something on the spit. Nope. If Havdan Uba and Ivar Ragnas on a lacking food. If Havdan Uba and Uba Ragnas on a lacking Have no worry. Ah, I can see it now. A suckling pig tender and juicy. <laughs> Whoa. And the ale as gold as the treasures that we failed to steal back there. A man of simple pleasures, aren't you? And he is happier for it. For my part, I look forward to standing in the footsteps of the giants that built this land. What giants? The great Romans and their empire. Giants of a forgotten age. They held dominion here long ago, and their ruins dot the landscape. Every brick and stone tells a story of conquest and glory. And now, they are rubble and ash. Ready to be remade. We will rebuild their empire brick by brick. And ours will not crumble to dust. All things end, dog. Ruins are not a warning. They are a testament. 
Look there, just ahead. Where the sons of Ragnar make their camp. At last! To find our feet on steady ground. Sigurd, go right. back. Something is right. Good eye. There is too little movement for an army. Only tents and a few men. Not the army we hope to find? No. Let us get a closer look. Alright, let's get closer then. So now we get to really get into like just killing the innocent, right? Yeah, it's pretty it's pretty effed up like that uh this is the way that people used to just take over areas. Yeah, they'd be like, Oh there's a village, it's ours now. Dag and I will go together. We all go. If they are friends, I wish to meet them as a yard. And if they are foes, then we fight them all together. together. Alright, fair enough. Regression's encampment. Who are these men? They speak with twisted accents. English, no doubt. Dark Avon! On me! Can I can I get off the Alright, can I get out of the boat? Can I can I get out of the boat? Please. Okay. Cutscene. Okay. Got a cutscene me out of the boat. I get it. Cutscene me out. Give me that sweet, juicy, hot cutscene action. There it is. Oh, God. It's on my chin. It's on your chin? <laughs> oh, chin what's nuts? This? A mess of filthy Danes befouling our riverways. Wow. Language. You there? Give us your name. I am Sigurd Jarl of Fornberg. <laughs> and you are men who do not take kindly to Dane invaders creeping into our camp. You'd best move along, pagan. Spare yourselves a slaughter. Pagan. You pagan like Wiccans. swords and expect us to cower? I have been eight days at sea without a drop of blood to wet my axe. Wow. So spare the wow. chatter, bucket out. And draw your weapon. Keep your axe wet. Oh! <laughs> oh, they want smoke, man. They want the smoke. You're just That's wanting in, dude. Four boys, five boys. I don't care, whatever. <laughs> they wanted oh. the smoke. Oh, he put dirt in my eyes, dude. Oh, dude, they fight dirty. They do fight dirty. That's dirty fighting, dude. Dirty pool. I'm sorry, I hit my own man because I can't tell the difference. Everybody looks the same. Don't attack the blue guys. Really? My dude? Okay. I see you. Now you get smashed. Guess what? You get smashed. Oh, I love that combat attack. It's my favorite thing in the world. Yeah, so these guys were just like chilling on their doorstep and we just came in and started killing them. Yeah, dude, they're like, hey, guess what? It's Zara Town. And you're like, it's my town. <laughs> Dead. Basically. Oh, is this the guy I'm supposed to kill? Consider it done. He's dead. What else? There's another man over here with a chevron above his head. I'm guessing he's of some import. A man of some repute. You're finished. Nope. You're, could you move? Oh, you just got smacked in the griddle chops. Your chops are now griddled. I love griddle chops. I'm just saying. I don't know if you like griddle chops, but griddle chops are pretty damn awesome. Oh, I assume that a griddle chop is a pork chop that is cooked on a griddle. I don't know what a griddle is though, and or why it's called a griddle. A griddle is one of those flat heated <laughs> cooking surfaces. <laughs> dude, I knew you knew what a griddle was. Yeah, dude. It's just like a it's like a hot plate. <laughs> I mean, essentially, like a griddle is like it's like. A burner on the... It's like, okay, we have a glass top stove, right? Yeah, sure. So, so instead of it being a circular heated thing, 
it, like the whole square would be hot. So, so it's like imagine you cook on our entire stove top and it was all equally heated so without like, a pan. So like what they use at like McDonald's, Wendy's, or Wendy's essentially. Yeah, any fast food restaurant, they all use the same. Well, thing. McDonald's doesn't because or Burger King because they use different stuff. Wendy's uses a griddle essentially to cook all their food because they live real time cook that meat to put on the burgers. Wendy's uses a broiler and McDonald's uses like a press or something. But a like press, they press their meat. I think so. Yeah, dude. What is this man McDonald's doing? or Wendy's uses a true like griddle play. I would love to have a real like, dude. What is happening? Oh. <laughs> He's a statue, bro. What is happening here? <laughs> what is what is happening? He's floating, dude. Take that photo. Put that online. Why is that happening? All right, that's very confusing. But uh, I didn't know they used a press. McDonald's is like he has a meat press. I think so, yeah. Oh, that's so gross. I mean, it's efficient, but I wouldn't want to see that made. Yeah, dude, like wow. Wendy's has an actual, like, dude, like imagine if our stove, the entire cooking surface was hot and you didn't have to use a pan. You could just like cook eggs in one spot, cook like chicken on the other, and it was all equally heated. That's a griddle. All right, man. I, I mean, I get it. Though I'm, I'm way, I'm way more like kind of just shocked about this whole meat press. And now I'm thinking like, do I want a meat press? I mean... Ask Chach, he's working down. I just picture like a like a perfectly burger shaped like circular press and you just like take one big handle and you just like press the meat onto it. Imagine Is two hot it? plates, hot on the bottom, hot on the top, yeah, and you exactly. close it down. But it's not it's it's like just a flat square. It's not shaped like a burger. And the burgers yeah, are already I mean, pre pattied and then you just heat them on the top and bottom at the same time. That actually sounds amazing. And then like and then essentially <laughs> McDonald's they make all the burgers and they slide them in like the heat trough and then they're ready to go. That actually the heat trough. Like Wendy's is MTO, bro. Like made to order, dude. You get it as you order it. They don't got that ish pre pre wendy yeah like yeah. when you go get us baconators in the morning when you're doing baconator friday or whatever day it is <laughs> they are fresh made baconators especially because yeah. you order them like a special way yeah you can tell by the amount of time that i have to i have to wait <laughs> the for them. 20 minutes i have to wait for them <laughs> but yeah they are fresh yeah exactly and you can tell the difference oh dude and you really can't even if you go to wendy's and you order like a just to say a quarter pounder you can get, like, I want me ketchup, mayo, onion. Like, it's fresh. It's not, like, soaked into the bun. It's, like, because they make it right when you order it. It's a lot better, dude. It's, yeah, it's actually pretty great. Um, Not that that stuff's, like, good for you kids. Don't no, eat it. No, no. Wendy's has always been my favorite place because it's fresh. Like, you can order it, like, yeah, the meat is chilling on the grill, but, like, they make the actual sandwich when it's ordered. Hey, vote. Look at this. That's why when you go to McDonald's, if you order it without pickle, they have to make it like fresh because because everything's made with pickle and onion. Because you know? they already have them made up. Mm. Put a bunch of boxes in here, dude. In here, those men are prisoners. I found prisoners, Jonas. Let's set them free, or actually, let's bring them in. Let us walk, and we will not hurt you. Quite bold in those bindings. I like your spirit. We are very agreeable people, I promise. You need not kill us. Peace, friend. We have no need or wish to hurt you. What are your names? Oh, look at him. Now he wants Yenli. to be friends. I'm a merchant, not a bandit like those others. And this is Rowan. Rowan, that's right. I'm a stable hand, that's all. I keep horses and, well, I did, till those brigands sold them off. They meant to sell us next as slaves to the nearest bidder. Jesus. But I wrecked their eyes out before Jesus. I let that happen. And how did you find yourselves here? We came to trade with the sons of Ragnar at Hastan Yal's asking. But they were gone when we arrived. Unbind them. Uh, you will come with us. Sigurd is a saint. Yeah, uh, just killed like a whole you bunch of guys. Nah, no, dude. Ragnar? I... Sold many a mare and stallion to the brothers. Good men. Always paid me fair. From the look of this camp, they've been gone for some time. Where will you go now? 
What will you do? Repeat my stocks. Start anew. I have friends and allies across the land to aid me, but it won't be easy. You got friends Every right town here. Every village needs a stable to keep horses fit and trim. I'll find my footing again, somewhere. <laughs> Bring them in. We could use what people like thinking? this. We could use Aww. your skills as we get settled. Yeah. yeah. Trade and someone to tend our mounts would be a boon. My thoughts as well. Any friend of the Ragnarsons is a friend of mine. Right, Doug? Whatever you think is best, Sigurd. Janli, Rowan, I am Sigurd Jarl of Thornberg, son of Stilbjörn. This is Eivor and Dag. Dag. Both of you are free to go. Wood. You're more than welcome to stay if you're willing to pull your weight. We'd be happy to, if only to get back on our feet. Then let it be done. The Raven Clan welcomes you. I like how they're putting Asians in this game. Yeah, dude, it's good. From strangers like you never see that. to friends into family. Oh, somebody put the horn of war. The others out. have arrived. That signal Come. in the sky. Savages. <laughs> I have a good feeling about this place. Oh, is that the all clear family, horn? Friends, welcome to your new home. Oh, so now we make a new town here, dude. We need a montage. Everybody's working and carrying boxes. Montage. There's a man with a barrel and a horse ridden donkey. Pick up that shield and put it over there. Blueprints? Hell yeah, dude. That's real montage action. We gotta fix that crack in the roof. Oh, we got it. Cassandra's on the job. And now I have a town in England, bro. Yeah, dude, you're like the London Queen. Hell yeah, put a big bin right there in my front porch. And the bird flies, dude. I own that bird too. That's my bird. Don't you forget it. So we got a stable guy and we got a merchant. So, like, you can buy, like, stuff from the merchants. Okay. But once I bought, like, all the uh, the rocks and leather from the merchants, okay. none of the merchants had rocks and leather. Fine. Oh, like you bought them out. Yeah. It was like 400 bucks. Eh, don't be a pee. Now come. Randvi has found something I would like you to see. Randvi. All right, what do you got for me, lady? Eivor, I got you a Randvi hole. I give you England and its four kingdoms. Mercia, East Anglia, Northumbria, and Wessex. Mm, never Wessex, heard of it. From if you ever heard of maps it. I discovered here, I believe the sons of Ragnar have pushed further into Mercia, here. My scouts will soon tell me if I am correct. And where are we? Here, in this unnamed copse of trees. Unnamed? We cannot let that stand. What will we call this place? Oh, do we I get to pick a name? An idea. Do we get to pick a name? Please. Ravensthorpe, the village of Ravens. That's an awful name. That's an, I'd had no input on that whatsoever. I, like I disagree. It. Yeah. He sings once again. One day this name will be known throughout all of England. A name is only a beginning. If we want renown, we must build, expand. Agreed. We should begin with a forge. Can you help Gunnar get working again? We'll need cargo, supplies. For that, our neighbors will provide, whether they wish to or not. Scarcely arrived, and now we must raid. Mm. We cannot master this land merely by asking. I'll go and speak with Gunnar now. That's Good how work, stuff happens. Dear. You and get there and then you gotta fun. start killing people. Short notes mostly. <gasps> and two and more points. I gained two a level more points. I get more skills. Yeah, I get better at things. Stuff too. <laughs> 
beautiful song. Dude, I'm a good singer. <laughs> Don't even say that I'm not, bro. <laughs> Don't. All right, I gotta go this way to get to that. Yeah, man. dude, you might as well break the fall, you know what I'm saying? Unbreak <gasps> my ah! fall. Unbreak my fall. Last chance healing. When your health reaches a critical state in conflict, everything around you will appear to move slower, giving you time to heal or flee. So you want me to be a big OP? Is that what you're saying? You just want me to be a P. Big old P boy. Slow down time. When, oh my god, I'm hurt. Oh my god, I'm almost dead. Let me slow it down a little bit so I can live longer. <laughs> Cuck me. Wow. <laughs> I like that, though. I did. I did like that, but whoa. <laughs> that was a lot. I liked it. <laughs> no, I don't even know what good. I said to be honest. Dude, it was all very improv. No, it's fine. It's cool. I can't look at this apparently. I want it so bad. Oh, uh, you got to speak important. to Gunnar. I don't want to speak to Gunnar, dude. I want to go. I want to go check out my shops. I want to go check my village out, dude. I got a village now. I own this with my brother, of course. You know, it's kind of kind of messed up that I'm just basically my brother's pee. Mm. I'm just like, hey, whatever. He's not you... really your brother. He's, he's like your. your bro... What are you going to say? Like he's my step brother, bro, but we dude. grew up together. I mean, that's like that step bro <laughs> videos you, you watch. Weren't you the guy that t said that you didn't understand why a person would call him step brother if you lived together? Weren't no, you... it wasn't me, I don't think. That was 100%. It was on an episode of this. Wait. You said that you were like, uh. Did I... I don't understand why they would call him a stepbrother. It's like, this is your brother. You grew up with him. You lived in the same house. You're family. No, that's not me, dude. That will, I don't talk to anybody else. He stopped pirouetting. Nah, dude, because you would bang your stepsister. Wait, what? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> what? <laughs> you got to go, like, squeeze one off, man? Nah, you need to, no, I'm just saying. No, I'm, just, I, I'm, 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 just, I'm just literally being an a-hole. Are you um, horny Did right I now? really say that? Yeah, I feel like you definitely I said that. I may have, dude. dude. You definitely said that. All right, well, I guess there's no... I don't know where my, my town is, unless it's, like, inside... What does this say? Interact. What do I see here? The blacksmith. Oh, I got to pay for it. I got to pay for it, man. It costs money to oh, make stuff. I am, dude. I should gather the crew and go raiding. All right, Can let's I go raiding. And... Dude, you got... Oh, look, he you came with... I didn't even know he came. Possible. He, oh, he definitely came. Supplies and riches. Ah, you mean to go a Viking then? Good, good. <laughs> How I miss those days. Ransacking and pillaging. Come with Blade us. Blade singing and shield splintering. <laughs> <laughs> Killing people. <laughs> Murder. Us, Get it? The blacksmith we have. We cannot afford your loss. Mm. Oh, it's no bother. Better I forge axes than swing them. My place is here, not pulling on the war of a river horse. <laughs> <laughs> Though you do remind me, I found a map among the bandits' rubbish, marked up with the locations of Saxon monk huts. Yes, bandits know as well oh, as we. Oh, I found one of those monasteries too. Monasteries are full of riches and loot. Take the map with you, and put it to better use than they did. All right, thank you. Open the world map, dude. Look at some stuff. Get that map. All right, so now I got... This is the first time... Oh, my. That's more like it. There you go. Now we got some map access. I can go all over these zones, probably. I wonder if I can go back over to Norway. Norwegia. Norway, Norwegia. So these are 160s. This is suggested power level 20, 90, 160. All right, so I really can't do anything out there. Yeah, in these but areas. on the stream, dude, you can just like straight up like explore. 340. 
this island. It's 340. You gotta be very careful out there. I do. There's a whole bunch of bird points and stuff we can explore, too. Heck yeah. That's why I wanted to do this, man. Now you got the freedom to get a whole new air. A whole new world. Don't you dare close your eyes. Yeah, it'll just make it. I just, I, I only fear that I'll get too overpowered and make like the, the game trivial. Yeah, but it's okay, dude. It really is. Like, no one wants to watch you struggle. They want to watch you dominate. Um, everybody wants to watch me struggle, it seems like. I like to watch you struggle. <laughs> Whoa, Jonas. I'm going to need you to <laughs> never say that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. I mean, in gameplay, I like to make fun of your shortcomings. <laughs> Never want you to see me struggling, especially like, ugh, yuck. All right, we'll go do this raid. Knock this raid out of the park. Boom, get it. But we'll have to do it on the next episode. That sounds good, because that's all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe if you've done that. Do Twitch with him. TNT Dynamite, I'm on Twitch. That's twitch.tv backslash TNT D-I-N-O-M-I-G-H-T underscore crazy T-M. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> for Jonas. TNT. We'll catch you on the next one. We uh, are uh, out. Uh...